I still no consider myself a Christian. Hot, I still consider myself a Christian. <laughs> I do. Wow. And what is, what that is, just what means that mean? I believe that Jesus died on the cross for my sins, and I'm not a fucking judgmental person like uh. you. Huh? All right, fam, so look, I came across a crazy, crazy video, and I did not watch this video yet. I didn't even see five seconds of the video first, okay? I just seen the title, and I said, oh, man. This is going to be a good topic. I'm going to enjoy it, okay? Christian OnlyFans girl gets called out. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, first of all, <laughs> you got me at Christian, okay? Because if y'all don't know, obviously, I am a disciple of Christ. You know what I'm saying? And I know I got a lot of supporters that don't believe in God. But, however, I guarantee you, until the, as long as I walk in this earth and as long as I continue to post videos, you're going to be a believer. Believe it or not. Okay, you go, you go be a believer. Watch. Mark my word now. Mark my word. But anyways, man, enough talking, man. Let's go ahead and get to the video. Fresh's toothbrush. Thank you for the uh, super chat, man. Appreciate it. Women can like older men, but older men can't like younger women. Question mark. Men and women don't have anything in common. Ladies, LOL. Are y'all okay? What? When yeah, women are doing it for ones, they're not doing it for pleasure most of the time. They're doing it for money. So they don't do it because they like older men. They do it because they like older men's money. If any young women are watching, please do not model your lifestyle after her. Oh, Thank Jesus. you very much. <coughs> He's judgmental. And that's from the Christian man. Yes. I'm looking out for you young ladies. If you I'm ever, not judging if you. you ever, that's fine. But if you ever want to get married, there's a lot of young girls out there who want to get married someday. If pictures of yourself doing things are all over the internet, your husband and your kids will not appreciate that. What are you he's speaking facts. Uh, he's speaking facts. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> Look, he's speaking facts. I'm just saying. But kids gonna think of this. They're I think Northwest is doing just asshole. fine. Nor Northwest. Yeah, she's living uh, her life. Kanye's. Yeah. Yeah, kids. she's doing great with her mom. Yeah, I mean, given the op given the option between a mom who has porn on the internet versus one who doesn't have on the internet, I would prefer if all of my friends couldn't see my mom fucking other dudes and sucking their dick. I still no consider myself a Christian. Hot, I still consider myself a Christian. <laughs> I do. Wow. And what is, what that is, just what means that, that mean? I believe that Jesus died on the cross for my sins. And I'm not a fucking judgmental person like oh, you. Okay. you, you okay, what gives okay, you the hold, right? Hold on, You're not hold perfect. Hold on, you hold should on. know better than anyone. Oh, my. I'm sorry. This is getting good already. Uh, let me go back a little bit. I'm, I'm not going to pause it. I just want to. I'm a hero. I'm a hero. I'm a hero. myself a Christian. <laughs> I do. Wow. And. What is, that what is, just what means that, that I mean? believe that Jesus died on the cross for my sins, and I'm not a fucking judgmental person like oh, you. Okay. you, you okay, what gives okay. you the hold, right? Hold you're not hold perfect. On, you on. should know better than anyone hold on. that we are sinners. Okay, you're right. We're not you're perfect. Right. And I, I know so I'm, get I'm, off your high horse. I, I, I know I'm not perfect. Okay. No, get off your high horse. What makes you think that you're better than everyone else? You I never are said a that. sinner. I never you are said recently that. born again. So then why are you judging other people? You can have your beliefs, but don't attack other people that's fucked up. Okay, this side of the table was saying that it's a great lifestyle decision. You said it's a great lifestyle, lifestyle decision at 18 to do that. I was encouraging young ladies. Did I say that for everyone? Did I speak for everyone? You I was, was speaking a, for myself. Okay, there's impressionable She's young girls out there. Let me, let me finish my point. I let her speak. All right. There's impressionable young girls out there that are watching this, okay? Mm -hmm. there's, there was a girl who was on this show that got into only okay? She had a lot going for her. It's the kind of thing that a lot of women are going to regret when they're older. You might not, that's okay. Second, I don't think I'm better than you. I don't think I'm better than anybody, okay? I'm, I'm a sinner that should be damned to hell, and Jesus rescued me from that, and I'm grateful for that, okay? But if you wanna talk about, you know, I, I'm just as good of a Christian too. Jesus said, if you truly love me, you will work to keep my commands. And he also said, he also said, go, he also said, go and sin no more, okay? And we're called to be models and examples for other people. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's what people don't understand. They feel like, oh, walking the walk at, with God. It's like, oh, I gotta be perfect. I gotta be. No, you don't have to be perfect. Okay. It, it, you do not. It's not. This walk is not for you to be perfect. This walk is so that you can live a righteous life. You have to live just as Jesus lived. The way he walked this earth, yes, he lived perfect. But also he know when he died on that cross, he already knew that we we're going to continue to sin, continue to sin, continue to sin, continue to sin. That's why the Bible say die to yourself. Die to yourself. If you want to be a true follower of Christ, you have to pick up your cross. You have to pick up your cross. You have to carry that thing. 
You know what I'm saying? You can't you can't be a lukewarm Christian. You can't be like, oh, I'm gonna be an OnlyFans girl, show off my body for for uh for the approval of men and things like that, and get my money and this and that. God said that he has a plan for you. God said he would never leave or forsake you. God said that he loves you regardless. So why are you looking for other things and all the things that you're trying to do for some money? You cannot sit here and say that, oh, I'm a Christian. That, that Christian word flows around so loosely. Everybody in their mama th believe that they're a Christian because they believe in God. No, you are not a Christian just because you believe in God. Even the Bible tells us that he will say, uh, that people will come to him and say, Lord, 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 we did this in your name. We did that in your name. He's going to say, depart from me. I never knew you. That's like the most scariest scripture ever. Imagine you thinking that you know God. As you live on this earth, you think that you know God, but the whole time you only know of God. So you continue to walk this walk on earth thinking that you can live the way that you want to live and think there will be no consequence in eternity. See, that's that, and I'll be making polls like, would you rather spend eternal life with Jesus or get a billion dollars? And so many people say a billion dollars rather than spend life with Jesus. Like, it doesn't make sense. And I feel like the society that we live in, like, this is it, it's sad, bro. It is honestly sad. I don't know why people don't want to believe. I don't know why people don't want to walk this walk. I get it. It's millions of religions. But Jesus didn't die on that cross for a religion. He died on that cross for a relationship. That's the difference. That's why I said in the beginning of the video, I am a disciple of Christ. You see, I didn't say I'm a Christian. I said I'm a disciple of Christ, meaning that I go out, I preach the word of God, meaning that I walk the walk that Jesus did. Am I perfect? No, I'm not perfect, but I'm not going to sit here and say that, oh, I believe in Jesus, but I'm going to still behind closed doors uh, commit adultery. I'm going to still behind closed doors uh, go have sex outside of me. Like a whole bunch of different stuff. You know what I'm saying? I continue to... I continue to live the life I lived before following Jesus. That's not me truly loving Jesus. If I truly love Jesus, I'm not going to walk the walk that I was already walking before following him. I'm going to walk the walk that he walked once he saved me. You get what I'm saying? I hope that makes sense. But come on, man. I, look, 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 look. This right here is what I love to talk about. You feel me? This right here is something that I love to talk about. Come on now. We're, we're called to model Christ. Do you think you're modeling Christ by doing OnlyFans? Oh, yeah. And uh, God did say... Uh, that we are supposed to be the light and the salt of the earth. So therefore, like, why we shouldn't be, this is why we shouldn't be walking like the world. We should be walking more like Christ because we're supposed to be the light of the, we're supposed to be the light of the world, the light in all this darkness. We're supposed to be shining brighter. <sighs> man, come on now. I could preach all day, bro. I could get a whole 10 hour sermon, bro. Stop playing with me, man. <laughs> I don't see it so black and white as you do. How he said he said I'm gonna be the type said, of Christian that I want to be. He said oh. the kind that doesn't follow the Bible. I mean, I'm sure that you're like following, like going I, against I, some I, of the rules. I fuck up, and I, I, I exactly. So I, don't and I, on and, other I, people. and I repent of it, and I repent of it. So do I repent. I pray every day. So you should pray and ask God to make you not so much of a judgmental asshole. <laughs> I, I, I'm I'm simply saying young women shouldn't follow your example because they'll regret it. Okay, well, they, young but women should do whatever, the, whatever they right, want. It's just a fact. It's just There's your opinion. I think, it's he, should, I think he should yes, caveat it. I think he should add the caveat. Oh, this is so good. Maybe like young girls who are looking for like a specific type of family life and future like settling down arrangement. Fuck it, live your life. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Guys, guys, Hold on a second. Do whatever the fuck you want. One, okay. Once you're fucking married, you can be pious as shit. Okay. One microphone at a time. Let's imagine, let's imagine for a moment. Look, I'm, I'm married, man. What do you think? Like, I'm, I'm the only one that's actually married here. Like, I, I like half the time mills. when y'all have opinions about this, it's just so it fucking mills. laughable. Like, what the it fuck? All right, that's, that's pretty rude, but hold on a second. <laughs> that's rude compared yeah, yeah. to what hold, you've been hold saying? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I mean, let's imagine, that let's imagine, too. let me speak, please. Let's imagine your guys' <laughs> kids are in middle school, okay? And, yeah. and they're, th your guys' kid's friend finds all of your pictures online and everybody starts sharing it in the classroom and they start teasing your kid and making fun of your kid there's literally been kids that have killed themselves and because of this imagine that hold someone on, comes into the classroom and the kid please because let that me happens finish in my point every day please let too. me finish Let's my talk point about that. please let me finish Let's my point okay? that. there's kids that kill themselves over this okay or hold on shouldn't. hold on if you're <laughs> is triggered if your kid yeah i'm triggered I have I, I'm triggered because I'm, nobody I'm can control their I'm fucking married. tongue. Just, just 
Please exercise some self control. Not even my husband. Hold on, hold on, stop, 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 Himself. Why should the mother who is a consenting adult who chose to do OnlyFans be crucified for her adult decision? Shouldn't it be the one, the kids who are bullying the child who led them to you're just commit? Bro, no, I'm sorry. I just like assholes here. So it's okay you're to bully them. Completely avoiding response. No, no, we're saying it's wrong to bully. Then what's the point? But you're what completely you avoiding responsibility. I'm just saying here. it's a point about like selflessness like i'm like a young girl has the idea of like doing an only fan getting such easy money by taking one naked photo of myself it's not easy money. My mind. you are not you'd make like five dollars okay <laughs> what oh. wait what Babe. <laughs> and you think that you will make any more than her i see i i don't understand the new generation of women or i i, I truly don't understand. i think that's probably when i got older i started leaning towards older women like my wife is older than me but I don't understand these young girls because, bro, my my thing is this: he has a point. When your when your kids find out about your your you know what I'm saying your graphy on on the internet, you know, and they look at these things, do you really think that would be comfortable for them to see that their mom is this way and see that other people at the school is doing things? <laughs> if you know what I mean. To your to your pictures and th bro, that's just it's not it's it's just not cute. It's not cute. And for you to sit here and say, I'm gonna go back to even a point where you said, Oh, I could be what well, I'm gonna be whatever Christian I wanna be. And that is what's gonna send you to hell. I'm not gonna sit here and sugarcoat it. I'm not gonna sit here and sugarcoat the Bible, bro. That's what's gonna send you to hell. Cause everybody feel like they could be the Christian they wanna be instead of being a Christian that God wants us to be. Not even being a Christian. Being the disciple that he wants us to be. So you feel like, oh, I could be whatever I choose to be and I'm going to go to heaven still because I believe. And no, it's more than just, oh, I believe. No, it's keeping the commands. It's walking the walk that Jesus walked. If you go claim to be something, then you need to show action behind your words. Because I could claim to be a game member, but if I ain't, you know, if I ain't stepping behind my set, you y'all would look at me stupid like, bro, you ain't really about that life. It's just like a Christian. It's like I seen a good example. Imagine you getting trialed, you know what I'm saying? You getting trialed or whatever. Uh, I'm trying to get the example the, the way he said it, but basically he was talking about how a judge, uh, could the judge see that you were a Christian? Something like that. It was like, imagine you getting trialed for Christian or not being Christian or something like that, and can the judge see in you that you are walking the walk that you claim to walk? It was something, it was a beautiful analogy that he gave. I can't think of it from the top of my head, but it was a beautiful analogy he gave. But however... If you want to sit here and claim to be something, then you need to actually walk the wall. You can't say, oh, I consider myself a Christian, but I'm going to still post naked photos online for the approval of men and for some quick money. Like, no, God has a purpose for you. And that is not the purpose that God has for you. Everybody can make money without God's hand being on it. But you will want to do something that God hand is on because you know that it came from him and it didn't come from the world or it didn't come from the devil because the Bible does tell us that the devil is the prince of this world. Look at the way the world is going. Look at all the LGBT stuff that's flying around. Look at all the 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 uh, the violence and everything that's going around, bro. This is literally Sod Sodom and Gomorrah. This is what this is where we're living right now. This is this is part 2 of that. Part 2 of that. Everything that God created for good, man done turned it around for evil. Look at the rainbow. Yeah, the, 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 the LGBT rainbow has, I think, less colors than the actual rainbow. I think one less color. But they took that rainbow and what God created, they took that rainbow and made it into a pride rainbow instead of using it for God's promise to never flood the earth again. That's what the rainbow was originally created for. I hope y'all get what I'm saying, bro. I, like I said, I could go on and on. I could be preaching a sermon in here, bro. Can I get an amen in the church? I'm telling you, man. I See, when it comes to God, oh man, I step, I step behind my savior, bro. Disagree on that one. So, Wait, I mean, so incredibly right. rude. Uh, I what? can't. I'm I'm nothing rude. She knows anyway, the industry. I'm not even. I'm not even saying. Her, let, her, let her talk. I'm let her sorry talk. I said easy money. I didn't mean that in a way as in like that OnlyFans is like an easy profession. I I know sex work is is hard work. 
But if I, like, if I could, it, okay, but weren't you just saying, like, yeah, it's better than McDonald's. I work a service job right now. Has the idea popped in my mind of, like, doing, like, sex work over my service job? I hope not, because we're already oversaturated the industry as it is. <laughs> what? Okay, so oh, fuck, good yeah. thing that it did, okay, it did pop my mind, but I, like, will never do that route, and it's because it's a Thank route God. of, like, of like self but i'm just trying to explain like a reason like why i wouldn't i'm not shaming it like go sex workers like get your back okay like good for you though be she, an independent strong independent woman opinions. i'm just explaining why i wouldn't and i'm glad i decided not to yeah and would recommend this to like and would recommend just girls giving it a second chance because but at the end of the i mean it's not even i don't even have to think that long term i have a family i love is is, yeah. is me getting 500 or whatever five thousand more dollars a month worth like shame to my loved ones and family members no like i don't i don't personally like it's it's out of it's out of like not wanting to be selfish that that's where that comes from me from if my you know i'm my my actions have consequences and at the end of the day i don't have to look think long term about my future kids what about my parents what about like my siblings i'm not going to put them through that because i want to get 5k more i can do more with my mind as well to make money that don't just involve like photos of my body so Agreed. i'm just gonna choose that route because i'm not hurting anyone that like i could if i was like my family if I was like doing stuff like that but I'm like adding value to society not that sex work doesn't add value that came across shady but in ways that don't add harm I'm gonna let I'm gonna let it finish out because it's gonna finish anyway I'm gonna let it my close family members which it would if I were to go that route so it's just an act of like selflessness to like not you're choosing to live your life for other people I'm choosing to live mine for myself and we can agree to disagree I don't I'm not gonna Anything okay, we're going to move on because I just need to get through all these super chats here. So, oh man, what a great, bro, what a freaking great way to start off the day. I, I, seriously, this was beautiful. This was honestly beautiful, bro. Shout out to whatever podcast, man, because in all honesty, dude, in all honesty, bro, this was probably the, I ain't going to say it was probably the best reaction I ever react to, but it's up there. It's up there. But let me just say a little couple points today. We're going to go ahead and get off the video. But I want to say this, though. When it comes to you, you talking about you live your life for yourself and things like that. That's cool. Live your life for yourself. But you're young, so your your mindset, your priorities is not straight. You're not thinking longevity. You're not thinking in the future. So you think it all oh, right now. I could get a couple dollars right now. I can get a couple thousand. But you're not thinking about oh, one day I might have kids. One day I might have a husband. How will my husband feel about? It? Because I ain't gonna lie, ain't no real man, no real man is going to marry a woman who has an OnlyFans. Keyword: marry a woman. Why you think some? Why you think so many men they 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 uh they don't marry a woman within six years, seven years? You hear people been, oh, I've been together with him for ten years. Y'all still not married? Nope. That's because you're doing something wrong. Because when a man knows, he knows. Don't don't let these men for when a man knows he knows, he know if he gonna marry you or not. But these men be leaving y'all like clueless. Oh, he said he had married me in our twenty years. Y'all be twenty years together and not married. That's crazy to me. That's crazy. You gotta get out of there. Like that's crazy to me. But you have to think ahead. See, a lot of us think right now, and right now is not good. It's not good thinking right now. We have to think about the future. How's my future kids? How's my future husband? How's my, how, how, what, what would I leave this earth with when I die? Am I gonna leave with little boys beating there to me? Or am I gonna leave with some type of influence on the world? Oh, she was a good woman of God. She did nothing but motivated people and push people. She wanted people to follow Jesus Christ. Not know, oh, well, she was just a woman who said that she was a woman of God and said she gonna live for herself and said she gonna be whatever Christian she chose to be. Like, no, you wanna you wanna leave this earth with some type of, you wanna leave this earth with something. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't wanna just die and people just knowing you all. She was a she was a peace star. That's what she was. She was just a peace star. Oh man, I remember, bro. You know how many peace stars there is, and you know how many dudes I hear on a regular day basically say, "Man, I remember when I was young, beat him up to her." Man, she was, man, I, I get some from her. Like, that's all they look at when they see you. They don't see you like, oh, man, she a wonderful woman. Oh, man, she's beautiful. She has a, a very beautiful soul. She She's beautiful from the inside. That, that's All they see is, oh, she's beautiful from the inside. <laughs> like, that's all they really see. I mean, the outside. Oh, she's beautiful from the outside. That's all they really see is what's right here. They don't see the heart because all you show is what's right here. 
Y'all women need to do better, man. Y'all women definitely need to do better. But I'm finna get off this video, man. I love each and every one of y'all, bro. This was an amazing video, bro. I definitely enjoyed this, bro. I definitely enjoyed this. This was super amazing, y'all. I love each and every one of y'all, man. Uh, I appreciate all the love and support. We on a road to 100K. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.